Hey guys. Let's make this animation. Let's open After Effects. Make a new composition. Okay. Draw a square. Let's give it a color. I'll select this pink color. Remove the stroke if any. Open the shape properties. Here in this add button. You get a number of options to select from. Select trim paths for now. Expand its options. Change offset to minus 400. If you change the end value, it will come in from top. Enable animation. Go few frame forward. Oh I haven't changed its value. It's okay. Add a keyframe. Go back to the first frame. Change the end value to zero. Select both the keyframes. Press F9 to easy ease them. Good. Close the shape properties. Now we will duplicate the shape two times. Press Ctrl D on the keyboard twice. Yep. Let's change the shape color on both these layers. I'll give it a lighter shade of pink. Now lighter than the previous one. Let's move the position of both the layers by a few frames so that each layer starts a little bit later than the previous one. Enable the motion blur on all the layers. Let's add text now. Take text tool. I'll zoom it in a little bit. Write the text. I'll write my channel's name. Ace Illustration. Let's increase the size of the text. Decrease the spacing amongst them if required. Align the text on the canvas. Do the required adjustments. Open the character panel. Change color. I'll increase the size a little bit more. Fine. It looks good now. Let's see the animation. Let's increase the duration of the animation to 30 seconds. 
Okay. I think the background color is way too light on this white text. So let's switch the darker shade on the top and move the lighter one at the bottom. Change the position to Good. Let's make the text pop out after the background animation is done. Here's that spot. Select the text layer. Press S to animate scale. Enable the watch. Make it zero. After few frames, make it 100. Select the keyframe, press F9. Drag the keyframe to the right to make it move slower. Let's see. A little bit more. Perfect. Enable the motion blur. Select the pen tool. Draw something like this. Remove the fill. I'll add a white stroke. Go to the properties. Contents. Shape. Stroke. Change the line cap from butt cap to round cap. I'll increase the width a little bit more. Fine. Open stroke properties. Expand taper. Change the end length. Select Add button. Trim paths. Trim path properties. Enable start watch. Few frames forward. Make it 100. Few frames forward. Enable end watch. Few frames back. Make it zero. It's way slower. Decrease the distance between them. OK. Move this layer. This shape layer will appear after the text. It's not appearing. What have we done wrong here? Press U to open the animation properties. Select all the keyframes. Move them where the layer starts. Yes.
Let's play the animation now. Yay! We did it. If you have any question or confusion ask me in the comments section. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video give it a thumbs up.